Ford's James Zabalski and Ray Ferraro along for the action, and two teams that just simply hate one another are ready to collide. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. The Islanders start with possession as we are now underway. Beauvillier's got it against the boards. Quick feed to Sabinashad. Shot gets in front of it. Quick pass to Beauvillier. And it's a quick pass to Pellet. Moves the puck over to Mayfield. Takes it at center. Here's a shot. That's turned away with the pad by Shusterkin. Stopped by the goaltender. The Islanders gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Up along the wing. Here's a shot. And that one's turned away. The Rangers get a hold of the puck along the boards. And that one's stopped. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We're still scoreless. Sabinajats won the draw. Moves the puck. Here's a shot with the stop. Directed over to Beauvillier. The Islanders move it in. Here's a chance, and that's stopped by Shesterkin. Stops him again. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. He was locked in there. The Rangers gain control of the puck. Moves it over to Kreider. Picked off in the offensive end. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Sabinajad's won the faceoff. And now he moves it quickly to Lafreniere and tries to make a diagonal pass to Kreider. Handles the puck. Scores! The Rangers have settled things down with the game's first goal. Still a razor-thin margin. You've got the one goal lead, but it's not like you're comfortable yet. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Pellix got it along the wing. Here's a shot. That's gloved by Shusterkin. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Past the halfway mark of this period, 1-0 the score. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Kreider's got the puck in his own zone. Feeds it over to Lafreniere. Here's a shot. Scores! That's two unanswered now. Uh, they stayed right on it. Once they scored that first one, they just pushed the pace of this. Now they get another. He made a great, accurate pass and picks up the assist thanks to his tape-to-tape -tape superstar ability. His teammates just love when he distributes the puck like that, guys. From the slot, wrist shot, he scores! They get one, and you think that the game's going to flatten out, but it doesn't. They pile two more after that. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. The Islanders get a hold of the puck off the draw. Moves inside with the stop. Picked up along the boards by Nelson. Oh, and it's another save on the play. Lafreniere is moving it ahead. A shot. And the puck dies with the trapper save. Here in the late goings of the period, the Rangers just recently adding to their lead. They're now up by three. Sabinajad's won the draw here in the offensive zone. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Nelson's taking it from his own end. 
Dunks it in. The Rangers gain possession along the wall. Sabinajad's moving the puck through his own zone. Moves it around along the half wall. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. Puck picked up by Nelson. The Islanders move to the offensive zone. The Rangers have it now. Passes it to Sabinajad. And with the buzzer, that puts a bow on the first 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here. They're ready to drop the puck here on period number two. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro bringing you all the action. The Rangers win it. Gains the zone on the left wing. Slides the puck over. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Right up the gut into the attacking zone. And now it's grabbed by Lindgren. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Lafreniere is able to take that quick pass. He's already got a couple of goals. He's looking for a third. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Rangers are in cruise control, leading it 3-0. The Islanders win it in the defensive zone. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Puts it on net. And there's the save. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Lee's got to take on a lot here as the captain of this team. And they're not playing very well. They're chasing the game. And he's got to be the one to grab everybody by the collar and say it's time to get back to work here. Takes the feet at the back end. Stays with it. The Rangers move the puck in the defensive zone. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Hammers a shot. Misses a golden opportunity there. Here's a shot. Turns it aside with the glove. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. More than half the period left to play. The Rangers have dominated this one to this point. They lead it 3-0. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Grabbed along the boards by Lafreniere. Puts it on net. Oh, what a stop with the paddle. I thought they worked the puck around pretty good here. They get a good chance on goal, but not to be. Fox has been able to get in on the scoring because of his zone ability, guys. It's one of his biggest strengths as seen already tonight. Sabinajad's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. Nice pass. And he slides it quickly to Beauvillier. Puts it on net. He scores! Anthony Beauvillier! The Islanders seem to have shaken off that funk here, Ray. They had to get going a lot better than they had earlier in this contest, now down by two. Taken by Mayfield. Sends the pass over. Big time stop. Chesterkins, let's go! Right on the doorstep. The rebound there to be had. And they made no mistake about tucking that one home. What a play by him to set up that goal, guys. His superstar ability was on full display, and he skates away with the assist. Puck scooped up by Pellick. Takes the bank feed. Pellick's gonna play it against the half wall. Stops him cold. From the place 99 made famous. Oh, that's gotta hurt, what a play. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Takes a shot and makes a save. Fox has got it along the boards. Puck grabbed by Kreider. He scores! What a goal! The Rangers have now gone ahead by a pair here in this second. 
Stretching out the lead here in the middle frame gives you a little bit more flexibility on the bench. The coach can use his whole lineup. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Moves it quickly over to Marcel. Takes a shot. Oh, he got a little sliver of it and it stays out. Zabinijad's aware of the importance of the first touch, guys. If the puck falls is away from you, it's no good. That's why his magnetic zone ability helps him settle down the puck to keep it alive. Here's a short pass to Lafreniere. Takes a shot. Oh, what a blocker stop on that. The Islanders have it against the wall. Moves it to Barzell. Puts the puck on net. Shesterkin's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around if the shift gets wrong. This helps. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Rangers have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Sabinijad's won it in their own end. Picking up some steam at center ice. And the middle frame almost done. The Islanders have the puck now. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. The Islanders will go to work here in the offensive zone. Stops him with a glove. And there's the horn bringing an end to period number two. Still 20 minutes more of action in the third. Stick around. Teams seem fresh after that second intermission. We're ready to drop the puck on period number three. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far, Ray. How do you see things? The Rangers continue to lead this wild hockey game. When you score, don't take a deep breath because the other guys are coming right back at you. They go on the attack through center. Skates to the crease. Can't connect. You try to generate enough chance. And that's the hat trick. Listen to this place. And here come the hats. I love this tradition. I know I will tell you. They collect the hats up. They used to give them to us. And you're like, what am I going to do? I'm not wearing somebody else's hat. <laughs> the Islanders are back at center ice. Probably breathing a little easier now, Ray. They needed to get one, James. If you trail by two for too long, the clock just runs out on you. You run out of time. Puck picked up by Lindgren. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Too many bodies in the way. Great save from in tight. They work the puck into a scoring spot, get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The Islanders have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to even the score. Gobbles that puck up with his chest. Both teams readying here for the face-off. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Islanders will play it in their own end. The Rangers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. No room for that one to get through. He was totally locked in on that play. And now it's grabbed by the front oh. air. Scores! Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, the Rangers have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Takes the feed, and he slides it quickly to Lee. 
Slides the puck across to Pellick. Here's a chance! And the puck makes off the glove. The Rangers will play it from the defensive zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Here he is in close! Oh, he makes a stick save, and that went right off the shaft of the stick. Puts it towards the net, and the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Takes the shot, denies him with the pad. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Quick feed to Kreider. The Rangers played along the boards. Here's a shot. Pad save. He's on it tonight. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. While fans being treated to some offensive fireworks, it's a 5-3 game. Taken by Mayfield. And now he angles it across to Lee. Carries it in. Lee's got it in the offensive zone. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Smothered that in close chance. The Islanders have it now. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Goes right to the crease. Glove saved by the goalie. Shesterkin's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Here in the late going of the frame, the Rangers holding down a 5-3 lead in what has been a fun one for hockey fans to watch tonight. Puck scooped up by Lindgren. And now it's over to Goodrow. Looking to set up offensively. Snaps one from the slot. Turn that chance aside. Into the corner now. Oh, what a hit. Those are the ones you feel in the morning. Paul Mary's picking up steam. Let's one go. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out for the back of the net. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. The Rangers take possession off the faceoff. Panarin stick handling in his own zone. The Rangers move it ahead. And that's picked off by Palmieri. The Islanders have done a really good job with their positioning. When they don't have the puck, they've been able to pick off several passes tonight. Quick pass to Nelson. The Rangers gain possession. Moves it quickly over to Lindgren. Puck dumped in. The Islanders gain control of the puck. Takes the feed. Comes up with a big time glove save. There it is, final horn sounds. We are all over here with this one. The Rangers were excellent in the face-off department tonight and a big reason why they come out with the win. Well, it seemed like they had the puck most of the night. They did everything pretty smoothly, and it all started in the face-off circle. On behalf of Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us. Good night.